What's going on? Brandon Costelli here from Mountain Bike Action Magazine. Today we're going to bring you something a little different. Of course it's fun to look at those high-tech carbon fiber bikes with electronic suspension, drivetrain, and what have you, but today we have something a whole lot more fun. It's a custom-built titanium frame featuring some massive 32-inch wheels. You heard that right. This thing's rolling on 32s. Let's go ahead and go check this thing out. We'll tell you all about it after we give it its first ride. There's a ton of cool and unique features on this bike from the fork to the handlebars and so much more. Starting with the fork, obviously Fox or RockShock or DVO, MRP, any of those guys, to our knowledge, don't make a fork that supports a 32 inch wheel. So Black Sheep took it upon themselves to make their own with this unique titanium leaf spring style design. The wheels are actually from a unicycle, believe it or not, big heavy duty steel rims laced up to some white industries hub. The seat has a Thompson dropper post with actuated by a custom made lever, allowing you to drop it and raise it. That lever's a touch hard to get to. You're kind of reaching under the nose of the saddle. Uh, but once you find that position and get used to it, it works pretty well. One thing we would have liked to have seen different, maybe a more flat bar. We actually did receive one, but with this long stem, it would have put our reach out way too far. On the bike paths, we actually really do like this more upright design uh, with this curved back look uh, and feel. Uh, as far as brakes go, there's ample power with some Magura MT7s. And then we went ahead and made it a geared drivetrain. Uh, you actually can run it single speed or even a belt drive because this rear end is fully removable. This titanium bike is super rad, it's very unique, and that's really what makes it so much fun to ride. We're having a blast on this thing and we're going to bring you a full review in an upcoming issue of Mountain Bike Action Magazine.